A pretty crazy chain of events involving stolen construction equipment. A burglar crashed that machine through a Boost mobile store and then into a church. This happened overnight along West Trade Street across from Johnson C. Smith University. Channel 9's Gina Esposito has been there since early this morning and she just spoke to the store's owner. You know, construction for the gold line is happening right here off West Trade Street. Police say the suspect stole a backhoe from this construction site, drove it up here right into this Boost Mobile store. Check out the damage here. You can see it broke off the door. There's glass everywhere. Even the roof inside is starting to cave in. Within the past few hours, I got this surveillance video from the store owner. It shows the suspects. Just after 3 a.m., you see an SUV drive by, followed by the backhoe. The suspect driving the equipment hit the store three times before the door came open. Surveillance video shows inside the store two suspects grabbing expensive laptops and cell phones out of the showcase. The owner says they got away with more than $49,000 in merchandise. The suspect then drove the backhoe around the corner to Bruns Avenue. He he crashed the backhoe into a church. Police are still looking for the suspects. The store's owner says he blames the contractor for not securing their equipment. There are too many people, crazy people outside. I don't know why they didn't secure it, lock it, do something like that. This is the stolen backhoe now parked on West Trade Street. There is some damage to its tires. Now, the contractor said they typically park their equipment here overnight and that it's pretty easy to turn them on. I'm looking into concerns surrounding that. I have a story coming up tonight at 5 o'clock. Back to you. We'll see you at 5, Gina. Thanks.